Hi, it's me again. I'm here to give you uh, a little bit of insight if you need help on doing this heel for the stocking. And once again, the pattern, uh, the link to the pattern will be in the, the notes below. So you've done your magic loop, you're, you're down to this point, and you're like, now what? So um, here we are, here's where I am. And I'm going to divide, uh, add a few more needles to one of my stitches. I'm sorry, a few, a few more stitches to one of my needles. So I'm gonna have 13 on one of my needles. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna knit across and pick up a couple more at the end of this. So per the directions, more here for the 13 all right then I'm gonna stop there and I'm not gonna knit these on this other needle I'm gonna turn that and I'm gonna purl those back now All right, then I'm going to turn that again. And here's where I'm going to do my slip one, slip, slip, knit. Okay, and then knit, knit across. Until I get to those last three, I'm going to knit those two together. And then knit that last one. All right. And then I'm going to turn again. And somehow I've got my yarn all. Okay. Then I'm just going to slip that one. And do the purl across. Continue to decrease following the directions and I'll pick back up with you when there are seven heel stitches left. Okay, so you've been you've been going along following the directions, decreasing for your heel flap. So we're just I'm gonna pick it up a little closer to the end. I didn't want to bore you just back and forth. Okay, so I slip one, slip, slip, knit on my knit side. And then together, knit two together, knit one, turn it. Anyway, this stocking really is very quick to make, especially with this lovely big yarn. Then you're just doing that purl row. I slipped that first one. Okay, so you've got your last five stitches here, and this is when you're going to slip, slip, knit. You're not going to do the slip one. You're just going to go right into a slip, slip, knit. Then a knit. And then you knit two together. So you have three stitches, and this is where you're going to pick up on the side. So... Four, five, 
And then you'll immediately pick up those stitches that were on the needle, okay? The ones that these are the ones that were not worked at all while you were at forming the heel flap and I had to turn a few around there. All right, you'll continue picking up these stitches and you'll pick up the five along this side and then your your circle will be complete again and you'll work down until you're going to get down here to your toe and then I'll be back to talk to you about the toe forming.